special guest. <laughs> Hi! <laughs> this is Carly. She's one of my besties and we're filming a fucking funny video for you guys today. As you can tell we have a little spread. We got a cheese plate with one type of cheese, <laughs> some red pepper <laughs> jelly and crackers, two bite brownies, our favorite <laughs> chips, sweet chili heat, and then this delicious <laughs> dip with pumpernickel bread and just finish it because it's amazing. And Tell then, them how many brownies you had yesterday. I literally had seven brownies yesterday. <laughs> seven. Because I was hungry after getting home from grocery shopping. And you know how that's never a good plan and I just bought absolutely everything. Um, and yeah, and we're just drinking our little twisted teas with these cute, cute, yeah. <laughs> cute little straws. Mine says, I don't get drunk, I get awesome. I ripped mine off. What did yours say? I didn't even read it. Rude. Beaks has never had twisted teas before. Is twisted tea, like, is that just a Canadian thing, you think? I don't know. Maybe. It's really good, though. Because of your widespread audience. Yeah, I have a lot of viewers everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> just kidding. Okay. So the type of video we're going to do today is actually a... I don't even really know how to say it properly. A mukbang. A mukbang. Tipsy best friend day. <laughs> Yeah! That's it right there. Love it. Click. Click for more videos. <laughs> Just kidding. Okay, so we actually have like a list of questions that we're going to ask each other. So like one question will go for both of us. So like I'll answer about you and you'll answer about me. Yeah. And then if you answer wrongly, then you have to take a sip. And we also have vodka chilling in the freezer. So that will be mm. after we're done with these. So let's get into it. Okay. The first question. Mm. When is my birthday? December 23rd. Yeah. Yes. I like thought about it. I'm like, wait. And you know what? That's funny because I was actually looking on Facebook today to add you to your Facebook. So I searched what your name would be. And then a bunch of posts from your mom came up. <laughs> and then one of them was happy birthday. On the, and then the date. Do you like, have my mom on Facebook? Yes. Oh, okay. It's so like it showed up all these tagged photos because, or like tagged words because it said Bada Carly. Or like, and your mom's last name is Bada on her Facebook, and then she was saying Carly. So then I was like, okay, birthday twenty third, which I already knew, but I just I knew that was gonna be a question today, so I was like, I know it. When's mine? I'm not supposed to be drinking. I won that one. It's February. Yes. I always get these, even with Shane's birthday. I always get them. Mixed I'm the up. worst. Thank God for Facebook birthdays, though. February twenty sixth. Oh. Twenty fourth. No. Twenty fifth. Twenty seventh. Yes. Drake. <laughs> I was so close. I that only was really close. okay. I the, it's so bad because I only remember Shane's birthday because it's a week before my dad's. Just think, mine is like two months after yours, and it's three days. That's after. too much. <laughs> <laughs> like that's not, that's not. Next question. Describe me in one word. Amazing. No. What is? <laughs> <That's> so lame. <laughs> Carly. Oh, that's even more lame. <laughs> okay. Describe to describe Me. in one word. Yeah. I guess like this question, there's probably gonna be a couple questions where like we can't really drink. Yeah, that's true. But we so should we'll just, just take a sip anyway. anyway. Okay, so to describe you in one word yeah. is I I'm just kidding. <laughs> I don't even think there's one word that can describe you. I know, it's hard. And I, I, Infectious? Is that a word? Uh, yeah, that means like you like project yourself onto others, but like in a good way. Yeah. Okay. That's well, let's just let's just say that's what it is because that's how yeah, I meant it. That's a good one. That's a good one. Perfect. What's the next one? Have we always got along? I think yes. Yeah, we have. We've, honestly, I think we've only gotten in one. Fight. That's the next question. <laughs> <laughs> what is it? <laughs> the next question is: Have we ever had a fight? Okay. Do you want to tell the story? No. Or do you want me to tell the story? <laughs> We're talking about Montreal. Yeah. Right? <laughs> okay. So, like, we'll share the story roll. Um. So basically. When we were 18, we went on an S trip, which is basically like an organized student trip to Montreal for New Year's Eve. And we were uh, roomies, and then our other friend Maddie was our roomie. And it was one of the last nights, I think. We all got way too hammered. And then I ended up going back home. This is X rated, though, so I don't even know if I just say this. <laughs> yeah. Basically, Carly got locked. 
walked out of our hotel. Weezy, if you're watching, go ahead. <laughs> Carly got locked out of our hotel while me and Maddie were in our rooms and we couldn't hear what was going on because we were busy. Um, and Carly was apparently like knocking on the door, like yelling at us to let her in. Couldn't hear anything. Like there was music going, you know, like people talking. Keep in mind, like when there's trips like that, they rent out basically like the entire floor of a hotel or yeah. in, in, how many people ever met. Because we were spying on the people. Yeah, that however were. many people. It could be like two floors Look or whatever. Look at this cheese. So it's chaos, complete and utter chaos. And I'm trying to get into the hotel room and I, I had taken, because you have to wear like a bracelet the entire weekend. Mm -hmm. And I had taken my bracelet off, I guess, because it was the last day and it was the last night and I just didn't care. And it clashed with your outfit probably. Yeah, that too. <laughs> and uh, I'm like, I was knocking, it's like maybe 3 a.m., maybe 4 a.m. at this point, who knows. Mm -hmm. And I'm knocking on the door and they're not opening and I'm getting angry. And then security, like they were always coming up and down the hallways because they were checking, monitoring everybody. And then they see me, this crazy psycho, knocking on a hotel door and I don't have any like I, I like ID like, that I'm, proof that she's on the trip. Yeah, and they almost that kicked me out of the hotel room. <laughs> and luckily, these girls that we had like a shared, conjoined room, conjoined mm -hmm. rooms. Yeah, so we basically kept our door open in the room, so we were going in and out of each other's rooms. Yeah, and they were either just getting in. I don't really remember. They were getting in and. They're like, what's up? And then I explained <laughs> them the story, and then I slept in their room, and we didn't talk. At I was all I was day. devastated because I honestly didn't hear her, and like she was so pissed, and like came in the room like guns blaring, and I was like, what happened? I didn't. I what? What's going on? We were like packing our bags in silence. Yeah, she was like, packing her bag and was like, I fucking hate you guys. I'm not sleeping in here tonight. And we and then I like controllably couldn't stop crying. <laughs> And we drove to Montreal, so the drive home was like what? Ten hours, twelve, yeah, something. 10, twelve hours. And we didn't talk the whole way. No, I was sitting at the front by myself, being emo, listening to <laughs> my iPad, my iPod. It was yeah, so was, sad. Was that like iPod Nano or whatever at that? No, I had the big one. The the one hundred and sixty gig. Oh yeah, because you, you always have lots of music. Lots of music. So yeah, that was our only fight ever, and that was like when we were eighteen, and now we're twenty five and twenty six. So yeah, that's a long time ago. Um, when did you first, when did you meet for the first time? Um, in high school? Yeah, we went to high school together. And obviously, like, we kind of knew each other in grade nine, but we never hung out. Mm -hmm. And then... Because I was in, like, because was English. English? <laughs> and, well, you were, like, you were in all in English. Yeah, yeah. And I was in French immersion, and there's kind of, like, division. So even though it's, like, math is in English, but you would still be with your French immersion people. Yeah. If that makes any sense. Even though everyone was like friends with everybody, yeah. like, we never got close until like grade, grade 11. Grade 11 and then definitely grade 12 when we went to Cuba. Yeah, that's another story. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, how many, uh, is the, oh, is there anything weird that I eat? You really love ramen and I don't understand the like, <laughs> <laughs> like I, I, I mean I've never, like I've had like the. Especially because that's where it comes from, like mukbang. Yeah. Like that it originated from Korea, which Speaking is like ramen and, and I know, um, I've been looking at these Doritos. The cheese is really good. Wait, yeah, eat ramen. And <laughs> I don't know, maybe I just haven't made it right or haven't had like good ramen. You'll have you to haven't had it. Korean ramen. Yeah, true. I've just had like the canned, like the boxed ramen. Like, you know what I'm talking about? Like the Mr. Noodles, like. Oh, but that's not even really the same thing. What kind of canned ramen are Sorry, you? Sorry, I didn't mean canned, I meant like prepackaged ramen. Something weird that you eat? Everything. <laughs> I know, I was gonna say, like, Beaks, like, literally does not. I don't like blue cheese. Don't yeah. give me blue cheese. But, like, that's not weird. Like, you literally like everything. And. I don't know you to <laughs> eat anything weird. No! Right, is it right down the titties? Yeah, I'll just steamroll myself there. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, I don't really know if you eat anything weird. I like all food. Yeah, you just, you're, you're such a food lover. I know. You don't discriminate in the food world. No. I fucking hate when I get food on me. How many brothers or sisters do I have? Okay. You have three sisters. And then you also have a brother-in-law. Two brothers-in-laws. Who's my third sister? Oh shit, there's three in total, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Me, I'm the third sister. <laughs> no, we have 
Vicky and you have Steph. Yes. And then, yeah, so that those are your two siblings. Mm -hmm. Me? Um, <laughs> let's get the hands out because there's a few. I know. So no, you... like, blood. Well, actually, one blood, but... Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you have a stepsister. Okay. I guess that you can call her stepsister, right? Yeah. How? I actually have four. Fuck. <laughs> you have four stepsisters? Yeah. What? Uh-huh. I thought you had a step. Okay, on your this, this okay, is so on Ron's side. Mm -hmm. Two. There's two. Mm -hmm. And you have a step brother, Brett. Yeah. And then you have a step sister, Mallory. And then you have a real brother, like a half brother. Half yeah. brother. Yeah. Landon, and then also Brooke, who is Mallory's and Brett's sister. So basically, I have a half brother. Two stepsisters on my stepdad's side, and then I have two stepsisters and a stepbrother on my dad's side. So I have a lot of siblings. Yeah, actually. you do. Next. That's crazy. <laughs> um, am I allergic to anything? Bullshit. <laughs> 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 don't you know if you eat apples, your lips like swell? No. I don't think you're allergic to anything. I'm not. Am I? Yes. You're allergic to cats? Yeah. And I think that's pretty much, and then you just have like seasonal al allergies. Yeah, seasonal allergies. And then the one drug, sulfa. But like, <laughs> really, how would you know that? <laughs> I even forget sometimes. <laughs> like, yeah, no, I wouldn't know that. Yeah. Um, our craziest memory together. <laughs> Next. <laughs> what celebrity am I in love with? Currently, or like that you have been in the past. Let's just do in the past, because I don't think I'm in love with anybody right now. One Direction. Yeah, insane. That's yeah, no, yeah, yeah. That's the money shot right yeah. there. That's the one. John Mayer. Yeah, I do love him, and I'm going to see him in concert again this summer. Who else would it be? If it wasn't John Mayer. Um, I did really love Adam Brody growing up, oh, and no. I'm Leonardo DiCaprio, but like he's oh, kind yeah. of like passe now, so <laughs> he's passe. <laughs> Two positive what is that facets? Facets of me? Okay. I'm gonna. S Wait, shouldn't you. In were you answering first and then I was You answering? answer. Like, I'm asking you the question oh, and then you ask me the okay, question. Okay, okay. So, one, su you're super kind and really generous. Uh -huh. and, and number two, I can always count on you, like, if I wanna hang out. You're always, like, down to hang out and do shit. <laughs> you're never, like, no, sorry. Or like, nah, I don't really wanna. You're always like, yeah, sure. <laughs> like, like this. I'm like, you wanna film a video? And she goes, yeah, sure. Yeah, sure. Yeah, sure. Yeah. And then, yeah. And here we are. Sorry, um, that. that's not aesthetically pleasing. Two. Like, let's hope we're answering this right. I think so. Like, you attributes. are. Um. You are in in incredibly caring, like mm. big time. Mm -hmm. Like it, like you care so much that like it, like it, like affects you. <laughs> you take it. You take. Oh my god! You I take feel it on yourself. Yeah. yeah, yeah. It's like also like a negative thing too. I find sometimes because it can be really draining. Yeah, I bet. It can be exhausting. Yeah. Feeling everybody else's emotion. Oh fuck. Yeah. And then um, you were you were so funny. You you're not like ha, ha like not like, like comedian not, funny. No. Just you're the just shit like, that I do. Is oh funny. my god, you're fucking hilarious. You're you're so funny to me. <laughs> okay, cool. Okay, then what's one negative thing about me? It's hard. Just pour this tea. <laughs> <laughs> Get ready. Let's fill her right up. Oh, she's a bad influence when it comes to drinking. <laughs> That's my negative one. I'll be you like, know, she's not the first person that would ever say that about Carly me. loves a good drink. <laughs> That's gonna go on her tombstone. Loved a good drink. And mine will be loved a good too. <laughs> 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 but when we get together and we like drink or go out, like I'll be like fine, like I'm feeling good, and then she'll be like, shots. I I, I feel like I don't really do shots anymore. Just cause Thank God, because I would die. I, I'm just ready to get browned out. I don't want to get blocked out. What's more. browned out? You know, when you just... I've never heard that before. Browned out? It yeah. sounds like... I'm like ready to get bronzed. Well, that's not what I was thinking that you were going to say that it sounds like, but... 
That's good. Interesting. Um, brown, it, yeah, it's like not not black though. But I it's like still, that, you know, same. feeling good, but like knowing what's going on and not dying. Aware, yes. Yeah. Okay, what's one negative thing about me? Uh, you have no patience. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I don't have patience. You really don't. Fuck, it's true. <laughs> I'm like, okay, that's it, I'm done. Yeah. And she'll just like storm away. Yeah. Or I'll really show it on my face that I'm like angry. Like, or, like if there if, if there is like smoke or whatever that can come out of her nostrils in times, like your birthday at Red Fang. <laughs> yeah. You you were like done. You're like I was over so it. Done. Yeah, that's true. I don't really have patience at all. But what is our favorite inside joke? Birds? I was just Oh saying. my This is your third one already? Our funniest like inside like slang, is that what it was? Yeah. Birds, because we birds. We were in Cuba. <laughs> I don't even really know. We were just like waking up one morning super hungover, probably still drunk. Drunk. And the birds were chirping and we all just looked at each other like so out of it. We're like, birds? <laughs> what is my dream job? Fashion um mer not a merchandiser, but like a buyer. Yeah. But not not so much for fashion. Maybe just like a buyer in general. I she does like to shop. I do. Do you want one of these? Yeah, I do. Um, your dream job. I'm not gonna eat this cute. <laughs> like, it's not cute. It's not cute food. Hey Google, play Drake Take Care album. Playing the album Take Care on. I'm like, you went to school for health promotion, but yeah, is that health. your dream job? No. No, it isn't. I just took it because it was like the only interesting thing that was in town <laughs> that I wanted to do. And it like so it did interest me, but I like I don't know. I would say becoming like a like a, some sort of personality. Aren't I already? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> just kidding. Okay, no, actually my dream job would be to be Guy Ferreira and just travel and eat. <laughs> be a food blogger. <laughs> Screw the clan candle vlogging. I want to be a food blogger. Yeah, that's true. That'd be super fun. You have to try this with the red pepper jelly. Do you call mm -hmm. each other? In any special way? Was that like a nickname? What's the question? Do you call each other in any special way? Like when we see each other, like I'm saying, hey Carly, like, ha, like I don't, I don't get it. Hey Zol. Hey girl. Bitch. Do I say any expression or phrase very often? The face you make sometimes is like. Yeah. What is my worst fear? Your fe okay, wh what are you afraid of or what is your fear? Okay, let's let's be more specific. What is my biggest fear? Yes. Like what's my like How to be more specific? <laughs> I don't know, like you what just am I afraid of? Is my the question. Oh okay, um, probably. I wanna say you're afraid of being alone. Yeah? But I love my alone time. You mean like forever? Like yeah. if I was alone forever? What is your biggest fear? Is it like a phobia fear that we're talking about, or just like... Just in general, I guess. I don't know. It's hard. I don't, we don't really ever talk about our fears. No. With friends. What is your fear? I'm scared of death. <laughs> or like, oh. losing fa- like... Okay, that, I agree with that. That's like, me. Or like, losing my parents like in a tragic way, or like anyone in- losing anyone in a tragic way, like, would like, just- Oh, I can't even think about it. I've it's never had this cheese before in my life. What? It's amazing. I'm so afraid to die. Drive my perfect day. Okay. You wake up. Mm-hmm. Like, not too much, like, kind of like 11, 30, 12. But too late. Okay, like 10, 30, 11? 10, 30. 10, 30. That's a good sleep. But then you're gonna chill in bed for a little bit. Mm-hmm. And then you get up. And you don't change. You're still in your comfy. Okay. There's definitely sushi in there. Ooh. Mm -hmm. I love sushi. It's either lunch or supper. Or maybe you'll do like tucos for lunch. Ooh. This is specific. And then you'll do sushi for dinner. Yeah. And then you'll lay on the couch. You'll chill on the couch with, with Jamie. I love watching. And you'll just like watch all the things. That does sound like a really good like... And maybe you'll go to the gym. Is that a good? Is that part of it? Yeah, like exercise is really good. <laughs> important. <laughs> but we have to go to the gym first, work up an appetite, and then eat. Mm -hmm. But yeah. And drink some wine in there. Too. Oh yeah, wine. On the couch. Yeah. That's good. Okay, my turn for you. Okay. Okay. So, 
Uh, mine's gonna be a little bit more descriptive. Um, basically, you have fresh sheets. <laughs> You wake up with fresh sheets and Shane is already making you breakfast. Oh, living Egg that. scramble with avocado. Oh. And then a protein smoothie. How do you know? And some coffee and he brings it to you in bed. Ooh. And your cats are there and like he's there. And then you guys are just chatting and eating and then you get ready, full glam, to go to HomeSense. Oh! <laughs> yes! HomeSense! Yes, especially the new home sense. Yeah, and then you go to like a pub somewhere, like Hard Rock, <laughs> and you get all the snacks. <laughs> and then you go home. Oh, and then you get ready for dinner with your family, mm. and you host. That's it. Yeah. And then you hang out with me. <laughs> yeah, that was pretty descriptive. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's so true. So that was a good one. You got all, you the got all the, all the main like. All the main one. I feel like I'm missing others, but I think that's like pretty much the just. I think that's the just. Yeah. All right. Next question. What was my most embarrassing moment with you? Yeah, I feel like we don't really have embarrassing moments because we don't like dwell on the shit that we do to make it like to be embarrassed about it. Mm-hmm. True. I was gonna say when you puked all over um, Farragut's. Is it? Do <laughs> Yeah, that's pretty funny. Don't remember it though. Um, at Amanda's birthday. Yeah. And they had to shut down the bathroom. <laughs> and then I decided to walk home to Amanda's house in Garson and I got lost. Lost. <laughs> Fell because <laughs> it was pure ice. And then my uncle and my cousin were out looking for me. What about me? Have a nice life. Oh! <laughs> Basically, we had a, like we went to a friend's party um, back in the day. And then we ended up sleeping over, and then it was super awkward in the morning. We had to sleep over because because no cabs were driving. No cabs. Up to Chevy. No. And then in the morning, like we all woke up and we were just like, "This is an awkward situation," <laughs> for many reasons which we won't discuss. And then Carly at the top of the stairs is saying bye to everyone, and she goes, "Have a nice life." <laughs> and then we peace. In the cab. <laughs> I very hesitated. I didn't know what to say. Was... Name the song I love singing to in the car with you the most. You sing every song. With you. We sing together. Anything from mm -hmm. Drake's Take Care album. Which we're currently listening to. Yeah. Love that. Ah, no, the crackers! <laughs> this is a me This jelly, though. These crackers are good, but they're hella, like, not very strong. They can't handle their shit, okay? Which is my favorite TV series? One Tree Hill. Yes. Fine. The OC? Mm. Oh my god. I like it, but I actually didn't even finish the last season. Okay. I own um, it, but I haven't watched it. Oh, Sex in the City. Yeah! I love that I one. I always forget about that. I know, it's such a good one. Yeah. I love that one. I binge watched it, like, last year. Should we do a shot? Yeah. <laughs> Is there a smell that reminds you of me? Anything from Bath and Body Works? <laughs> like, anything <laughs> that's, like, cupcake? Cinnamon, uh, cookie. Um, hey there, cookie. All the <laughs> donut. Donut. Just, all the sweet, sugar donut. sweet, sweet smells. Yeah, I like, do like those. She, she loves those. But I'm kind of growing out of it. Like, did you see my candle collection? I hardly have any left. The smell that reminds me of you is Dolce and Gabbana light blue, which broke my brand new perfume. <laughs> In Amanda's basement, I literally, I think it was the first day I, I had my perfume. Yeah, that was And really she sad smashed it all <laughs> over. Like, she smashed it and it went all over the place. And Amanda said that her basement, her house, smelled like light blue for like ever. I wish Beaks liked country. Liked country. Hell to the no. Why? I don't like country at all. I just can't. I can't do it. I like a couple songs, like to, that tequila song with Dan and Shay. I like that. <laughs> But that's about it. That tequila song. What do I order at the bar? Um, gin, soda, what's pineapple juice? Wrong. What? Gin and tonic with pineapple juice. Well, you should drink gin and soda with pineapple. I should. Tonic is like as much sugar as a can of coke. I don't understand why. It doesn't even taste like sugar. Oh. And you always and get- And you have to squeeze a lime in it because the garnish actually plays a role. It masks the, the alcohol taste. Right. 
And you, she just drinks vodka on the rocks with like water and lemons or limes. Yep. That's or, it. or beer. Mm -hmm. Michelob Ultra. No. Miller Lite. No, <laughs> I'm just kidding. You don't know my beer? You would have so many. I, don't I went through, no, I went through a stage when I was just a light beer drinker. Yeah, Michelob Ultra. But I can't drink that crap anymore. I'm a full on either craft beer uh -huh. or Stella. Stella, yeah, that's true. My girl Stella. I don't really like beer all that much. Like, I'll drink it on a summer's day. But that's about it. Like, I'm more of a wine girl. Mm -hmm. Or like a sangria, a vodka, sangria. Like I love my mixed drinks. Anything with like coconut and pineapple, I really love. Ooh, what do I put on my pizza? We both read that. It's oh my god! That's so weird. <laughs> what do I put on my pizza? There'd be cheese, pepperoni, mm -hmm. bacon, mm -hmm. um, onions, mm -hmm. olives. Mm -hmm. What kind? Green. Yeah. And then like a green peppers. Mm. No. No, just basically those. Or minus the onions. Or, just. or pineapple. I do like pineapple. Actually. I, I'm a pineapple lover. I have to crave it though. I have mm -hmm. to be wanting that. Because there's a difference. There's sometimes when I really want pizza. Because you can't dip a Hawaiian pizza with like topper skin. Yeah, you can. Oh, I've done it. It just doesn't work. The pizza that's currently in the fridge that I had today is from Great Lakes. And it's a garlic butter crust. Always. With pepperoni, cheese, green olives, bacon, and pineapple. So that's like almost all of the things we said. Whoa! And she didn't even cheat. She didn't even look. I didn't even know. Okay, if you had a pizza, mm -hmm. I feel it could be something with like chicken, mm -hmm. like veggie. I'm very much plain pep a and basic cheese. bitch. Yeah, pep and cheese uh, stuffed crust from Pizza Hut. Ooh, yes. Mm -hmm. The topper's dip. Do you ever get it though where you're like you crave pizza but from different pizza places? places? Yeah, like we get pizza at work every Saturday, so it's always Great Lakes for me. It's not one of my favorites. I'm not a huge Great Lakes fan. And their dips are not as good. I, I love Topper's Pizza, but it doesn't love me. Yeah, no, I have instant shits after I eat it. <laughs> <laughs> like anything else that I eat, really. Yeah. <laughs> We're going to let a celebrity be in our group of friends. Who would we ask? That's Trisha Paytas. Trisha Paytas, yes. Yeah. But she's like not really a celebrity, is she? Mm -hmm. She's a definite influencer. We're trying this Kettle One Botanical Vodka. Hashtag not sponsored, but if you want to, send me some shit. Peach and orange blossom. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. Oh, it burns! No! <sighs> oh! Hail oh vodka! Hail vodka! If we're gonna let a group, a friend, if we're gonna let a celebrity into our group, who would it be? You would be Trisha Payton. Can I say who it would be for me though? Yeah. Chrissy Teigen. Oh, good one. She's funny. I fucking love Chrissy Teigen. And she would cook so well for us. <laughs> of course. <laughs> oh. It doesn't have to be a girl or a guy. It doesn't matter. I don't fangirl as hard as you though, so maybe you wouldn't know. I don't even really know who I would choose. I don't think I wouldn't. I, mean, I would say Tr Trisha Paytas. She's cool. Or. Or like Remy Ashton. I fucking love Remy. I have no idea. YouTube. Who that is. Oh man, she's a gem. Ooh, I have one hour to spend five thousand dollars. Where would I go? Definitely go for Sush. Yes. And then you would go to. Body works. Nah. What? I'm actually over it. You're seriously? Yeah. Good. Um. <laughs> it's like just dying. I, I was never even when I worked there for like a sneeze and a half. A season. I was, uh, Christmas season. I was never even like people would be like, Oh my god, this is the biggest candle sale. We <laughs> have to get all the candles. And, I'm like, <laughs> and you're like, bitch, I don't care. I'm just here for the money. Yeah. <laughs> Like, I'm just here working my third job, trying to pay the bills, okay? Clothes? You go to, like... Where? You have to be specific! H&M? Uh-huh. You love H&M. I do. Forever 21 is good, too. Forever but would you go to different stores if you had $5,000? Um, no, because I'd want to get a lot of shit for my money. So you go to H&M, Forever 21, you definitely dapple dapple into some shoes. Ooh, yeah. I don't really know a store for that. Aldo? Steve Madden. Steve Madden, For like, yeah. that like store. Little Burgundy or whatever, like Sephora. <laughs> I go to Sephora. Okay, where would I go? Home Sense. 
the liquor store. And I'm wrong, but um, just hate that that's <laughs> known me for. Yo, you would you would have whole, whole a whole party. You would get all the drinks. A big bath. A summer party. party. Yeah. I love those. Yeah. Okay. So you'd go to you would probably go to Sephora too and like get a lot of good skincare shit. Mm -hmm. And then clothes. Fashion Nova. <laughs> Fuck, just I'm kidding. kidding. I've never shopped, shopped there. there. <laughs> I think you would get like a good pair of sunglasses. I, I love sunglasses, but yeah, no, yeah. I would get a good staple purse. Ooh. What's my middle name? Sarah. I have two. Mabel. What? Brianna Sarah Mabel Kapanen. I didn't know that. What? This is Carly Ann, right? Yeah, so basic. How do I comfort myself after a rough day? Food. Yeah. yeah. Food and laying in bed. Food Wallowing and snugs. in my food and sadness. Snugs. Yeah, snugs. You need sure. all the snugs. Yeah. But if, and for you, drink. <laughs> <laughs> you, no, you cook. A, you cook yourself something. No, I would clean. Clean. Oh, that's a good one. <laughs> I love ASMR. <laughs> That'll be our next video. Keep watching. Oh my when we first met, what were you most impressed by me with? When were you most impressed by me? When? Oh, like when we first met, what impressed you about me? Like, what do you think about me? How you were like, like, you never had a group in high school. No, I kind of wanted. You were always like, ah, like life of the party. Mm, this is good peach water. How you were like always just like willy nilly. Yeah, but I think. I, I didn't feel that way though when I was in high school. Like I that's I definitely how you pursued your per, like sh like presented. Maybe I think it's because like my best friends were at other schools. Okay, my first impression of Carly was that she was absolutely beautiful. Aww. And I was like, who's this girl? She's Stop so it. She's so pretty. <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah. And then at first I was kind of scared of you because I'm like, wow, she's like really pretty and like probably super popular and probably a bitch, but you were. No, only I'm, to the people that needed to be put in their place. I was I I don't call myself I was never bullied in high school because I got bullied big time in high school. Like I got bullied to the point where like I almost left that school. Alright, couple more questions. Which two fictional characters, like fictional BFFs, are most like us? Like on shows, or like in a book, or like a movie. Uh, <laughs> Samantha and uh, what's her face? Carrie. Carrie, yeah. Okay, those are good ones. I was thinking like Paris Carrie. and Nicole. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> I'm Paris. No, just kidding. I'm not. Yeah, you are. Nicole. <laughs> no. Hey guys. So the camera just died because we've been filming for couple hours Far too long so we just wanted to come on here and like finish the video and say thank you for watching this far <laughs> if been, you watched this far if you even watched it really mm. um but yeah what are our plans for the rest of the night who knows who knows maybe we'll go out <laughs> after we finish all of our booze and our shane snacks and I, shane and i went to nickel city for a beer the other day and it was fucking pumping i'm sorry what can you explain to the viewers what Nickel City is? Um, no the, words. There's a weird smell. <laughs> of course, it probably smells like. But what's old that farts. show on Netflix? It reminds me of the bar from the show. Shameless. Yes. Yeah. Awesome. So yeah, thank you for watching. I'm like so vain. I'm looking at myself. I I'm always not. look at myself. Thanks for watching. And please subscribe if you want more vids. Thanks for watching. Bye.